it just becomes unaffordable especially like the good properties and then the cycle continues but, but they're going through the same thing that everybody w here went through right they're just because of the price point it's we're flooding them with people the prices are going up quickly and the locals can't fucking afford a place anymore and and, and right and then it, like it's just it's perpetuating the same cycle that we they saw out west that we see in toronto that i'm sure is happening in montreal like it just becomes unaffordable especially like the good properties mm -hmm. Right, and, and then the cycle continues, and it, it's it, it's uh, it's well, crazy, right? right? Like we're all talking about rates going right down. About, yeah, right done. Yeah. What's the wage out there? Yeah. What's your average wage? It's actually high. We learned this last yeah. time we talked to him. Okay. It's fourteen dollars an hour, I think. It's not that much. <laughs> fourteen, fifteen. Okay, now we're going. We're going for it. So, how affordable yeah. is five hundred grand at fourteen bucks an hour times two? Right. No, right. And, and this that's is the thing. thing. That's why it was such an opportunity here for investors. Like we were talking about how we want to start buying properties and doing rent to own. Because why are we, you know, rent so many people are, are paying 2500 a month, but they're not getting approved for a mortgage. But you're paying 2500 a month. It's been two years, three years. So it's so unfair. But for people like that, th mm -hmm. there's benefit, a lot of benefits in investors coming in here, buying those smaller properties and starting those rent to own programs. Right. And really for me, like it's, this is, this is a natural progression of real estate. Every country in the world has progressed in this way. This isn't something special, unique to Canada. Oh. This is just the way the world works, right? You yeah. go this back to 1900, you go Don. Don's boiling but, here. This is, this I know I see him. He's, Hold on. he's dying <laughs> because you know what? You guys are like the Antichrist. You guys yeah. are the Antichrist but to Don. Always, but also, also keep in mind that the people who live here already live here. They already have a home and they only pay 20000 for it. So when it comes time for them to retire and the only savings plan they had was their house, which they owned their entire life free and clear. Yeah. Now they're going to get a million bucks, half a million bucks for their home. Yeah. That's a significant chunk towards their retirement. So we're not talking okay. about new people coming in because... New Brunswick has always been the brain drain province. That's what they call it. So everybody's born here, but nobody wants to live here, but they <laughs> want to come back and retire. here. So they, they're born here. They, they get educated here. They move on to some place that pays higher wages, and then they come back for their retirement right. at those higher wages. Somebody who's working at McDonald's for $15 an hour is not buying a half a million dollar home. He, he would buy a home in Camelton for 100000 or 120000 exactly. yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. Don, Don, go ahead, let Don. it go. Let it go, Don. Don. Let's go. go. All right, we're ready. Right. What, what, what about students? What about, um, we're having a problem right now, housing students. PK, let Don speak, man. Thank you. Thank you, fucking Christ. All right, let's do this. It's the money. We've been inflated into shit. We have. So assets go up. Everyone, hold on, hold on. Rich dad, poor dad. Yeah. Buy a house, rent it out, blah, 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 blah. Yeah. Well, what did rich dad also say? Don't trust the banks, buy gold, and don't expect your pension. Everyone likes to forget those things. Like, you know what I mean? The, the money is just becoming more and more worthless. You don't think the central banks could- Pension is up. worthless. Why would you get a pension when you could buy real estate? Like, no, 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 no. But this no. is like, the choice in Canada. You, that, you know, you're missing something, Don. You're, you're, because you're, you're so angry, you're missing the opportunity that 25% of the whole country is made up of, right? No, hold on. It's such a large problem. It, it is. And honestly, I wanted to go to school to be a financial analyst. Like, I love money. I know how it works. Yeah. Let's do this. Okay. okay yeah. So analyze away. Right. <sighs> analyze away. All right. So does the bank love you, Daryl? My Save bank? My bank likes me a little bit. No, they don't. No, they, they don't like love me, money. but they, they, they'll they tickle they, my, they like my balls money, a little right? bit. TK's laughing because he knows. He knows. Okay. So let's just know that we have inflated to nothing right right it's just going to keep going it's the exponential curve it'll go it's going to run right like so the states are going to be 45 trillion dollars in debt in 2027 okay, okay? 2027 yeah. that's not far away everyone keeps saying real estate's going to keep going up so what for your average home in canada we're going to pay 20 million dollars but what's a can of coke like and how are the young people like look at all these tent cities that we keep talking about 
the price of real estate is killing everyone. Even the people that own right now, they're burning down their houses because they can't afford it. Like we have to admit there's a problem. Like I look at you guys like a bunch of crack addicts. You are. Oh, real estate only goes up. Look, it, there's going to be a breaking point. <laughs> yeah. Well, when when is agree. it? That's the thing is like, we're already talking about rate cuts, right? And I think everybody's, oh. hang on, dog. If you hang on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Everybody's already talking about rate cuts, right? And what's going to happen, everybody, it's not only the crackheads that are on, on the crack, right? It's like, it's the whole country. It's the whole country is somehow complicit and implicit in in the scheme right and nobody is willing to close their eyes and turn the other way everybody's trying to figure out how to pile on or in right and so now like 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 they're saying people are like when interest rates go down like these these investors are gonna flock like crazy and all the people that bought over the last few months who thought maybe I'm crazy are going to maybe look like geniuses, right? Because it doesn't really make sense for the economy to really start dropping rates now. But I mean, isn't it how it works when the media is all talking about something that usually like that's the next thing that's going to happen? Like rates are going to yeah. cut. So, but what happens, Don? Y you can be angry and you can be, uh, uh, you, you know, you can be skeptical, but like, they're still going to sell the real estate, right? The investors are still going to invest in the real estate, right? So, so like, is there a way to, to do it harmoniously? Because we do need the investors. People need a place to live. Regardless of if it's a building with 500 units or it's a bunch of, you know, three-bedroom houses. What's the difference? Okay, but let's just follow that thought. But are you angry at the apartment building owners or is it just the people no, that buy no. single family houses? I'm an electrician and a carpenter. I believe in real estate. Don't get me wrong. I believe in real estate. I Better. It as an investment. Yeah, I you'd did. be out of work if you didn't, did. right? Wow. You're part of the problem, like, oh, yeah, man. Problem. This is what you... Electricians and carpenters are part of the problem. Part of the fucking problem. You guys overcharge. Fucking Christ, the right? We're in this predicament is they just haven't oh, built right. homes fast enough, Don. Hey guys, thanks for watching our clips channel. Why don't you go and check out some more clips? We got lots of other good content somewhere over here. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Boom. That was good. That was good. That was good. I like that. That was good.